this short video I am going to demonstrate just very quickly how to use the new breakout rooms features inside of Google Meet. So I have a call here ready with some participants ready to break out and if I move my mouse down here to the bottom right hand corner you'll see the more options button here and if I click this one of the things in the pop-up menu here are the breakout rooms. So if I click on here Google automatically sorts my participants into breakout rooms based on the number of people in the room. It will generally aim for about three or four if there is enough people for that. And you can see here we've got two breakout rooms to start with. I can shuffle the order of the participants to put them in a different room. And if I decide maybe I want to move one from one room to another, I can do that and then move one back into the other room to do some manual sorting myself. If I want to increase the number of rooms, all I do is add an extra room up here. And at this point, I can drag somebody else into my new room here. Once you are ready to break out and have everybody go off into their rooms, I'm going to hit the Create button here. And breakout rooms are now in session. Participants will be prompted to join their breakout room. Once everybody has been assigned to their breakout room, you'll see that you as the host now have the option to join any room that you want by just clicking on the join button. Once you do that, you will be jumping into the room with those participants and you can have a conversation and use all the normal tools that you would normally use inside a Google Meet when you're ready to join a different room. Simply join the second room that you want to go to. And if you don't want to be in any of the breakout rooms, you just want to go back to the main room and wait for participants to finish up, you can just click leave and that will return you as the host to the main room. Once you are done with the breakout rooms and you are ready to bring everybody back to a whole group, you just click the end breakout rooms button here at the top it will send a notification to all the participants that the breakout rooms have ended and they are being prompted to return to the main room. Once everybody is back, you can carry on as normal with your Google Meet call. And that is really how easy it is to do breakout rooms inside of Google Meet.